Kitty, I have to keep pinching myself that we're actually here, and we've said this to ourselves all the way through. I feel extremely lucky that we found each other and find it funny, but also extraordinary to think that we used to run around the playground when we were four years old and we didn't know who we were or who we'd become. Later on, Kitty and I decided and started talking when we were around 16 or 17 years old. Just before she was off to rugby, Kitty told me, and she took the first step, that she told me that you'd like me. God knows why, but instead of saying the same back as a 16, 17 year old saying, yeah, I like you too, I told you that I was flattered and uh, that long-distance relationships don't work. <laughs> I can honestly say I have never been more grateful and pleased to be proved so utterly, utterly wrong. Thank you for not listening to me and never giving up. Over the years, we really have grown up together, though. We've, we've lived. We've had fun. And you've taught me that life's too short to overthink it, and sometimes it's best to just do it. You look beyond beautiful in every single way tonight, and you truly look like a princess today. You're one of the modest people I know, and also the worst at taking a compliment, but it's one of the many things I love about you. You're my best friend, my inspiration, my driving force, my adventurer, my laughter and my home. And I can't wait to explore the rest of our lives together. So a final thank you from me for doing me the greatest honor of all by saying yes. Oh, you're fine. Oh, you're fine.